Hey guys and girls, this is Gordon Overkill, I'm back again with the fourth sector of uh, the run of this uh, Zoltan sheet that I call the power water ship that I call the power metal, which is uh, now uh, completely filled with a whole lot of amazing American power metal bands: Leech Lord, Jack Panzer, Overlord, Hellstar, Explorer, Iron Cross, and Solar Eagle. That's a whole lot of insider tips for everybody who has not listened to this band yet, so make sure to do that. Well, apart from that, I think that we are doing quite fine at the moment, but we have just entered the fourth sector and I made the experience that the fourth sector is very often very, very dangerous. However, um, I think that one thing that we should do very soon is try to get this chain laser online that we got in the last episode because the chain laser would finally allow us to reliably get through two layers of shields and that's going to be very very important and therefore I think we should definitely go here and try although there is a pulsar pulsars could be a little annoying but I think we should risk it anyway go down to the pulsar and kill the ship there so what kind of ship oh that's one big missile aye, 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 aye. It's a ship that is manned with NGs. You arrive and find a pulsar dominating the view screen. You see a small silhouette pass in front of the star. Before you can ponder what it is, warning signals go off. It appears to be a ship in a firing trajectory. A pirate ship. Okay, here we go. They have got one shot laser, a very big missile, iron gun. That's the dangerous thing. I, we have to take that out as quickly as we can. Therefore, let's start with bonus energy, get everything online, and I think we should probably, no, we use that in order to shoot him. We need to get our lead to end because he has got two shields, we cannot yet harm him otherwise. So it's important that our lead to hits, hits the shields. And therefore we will, okay, there come his shots. Okay. Uh, I will uh, wait. How much? Oh crap! Okay, it did not take out our systems, and it took out his systems. If he now does not, no! Oh, oh, three points of damage. I was afraid that he could actually shoot our uh, shoot our weapons, which would have been horrible. So, but like this, that looks good. They sent you a message. Your ship is surprisingly well equipped. I know that. Uh, <laughs> please take this. He offers us an anti-ship drone and I think together with this anti-ship beam drone it's worth taking this. Yes. All in all that's uh, a good offer. That saves your life and uh, my uh, health points. <laughs> Three points of damage. Oh, oh my god. Should we go to the store? Or not? It's possible that we can buy some amazingly nice weapon there. Go to the store with 65? Yes, go there. We have to, a little stuff to sell anyway. <sighs> so, no weapons that we need. A scrap recovery arm is amazing. It's super duper amazing. If we sell the beam drone. And now, upgrade our weapons. Um, upgrade our weapons that means we can now put the chain laser online like this and we still have got enough money to buy the scrap recovery arm or not no we have to sell the Lido okay it's time to sell the Lido and buy a scrap recovery arm that is a little risky at the moment because now we have uh, too little energy but if we manage to survive this sector rather well we will be able to make use of that bonus scrap that we get and get this ship into an excellent state for the rest of the game. So, I guess this will be a really a deciding sector for the rest of the game. Cross your fingers, guys. Fourth sector, always dangerous. You arrive at a motoring NG research station. Is distress call un unanswered? Attacked by pirates or mantis most likely? They may be somewhat left alive some, there may be someone left alive or else something of value left on board. What do we do? Uh, we could board the station. 
we could use our improved sensors or our long range sensors to run another scan. We do that. Scans reveal the, uh, uh, the station's reactor is overloading. Not only that, but an injured NG and a functioning drone schematic are still on board. There's no time for both. I think we should rather take the drone. Sorry, sorry, NG, but we've already got three NGs on board. We don't need any more. <sighs> sorry, NG. The NG don't feel things the same way other species do. They'd want uh, the tech to be solved. <laughs> Your away team heads straight for the goods and returns with uh, time to spare. You put some uh, distance on the station before it blows. We get the boarding drone, which is nice to sell, and we get 15 scrap, which is nice to have. <sighs> Pure energy. I'm <laughs> feeling a, a little bad. However, let's go up there and do this fight. Yes, we do that. We're running a little low on fuel, by the way. Stumble across. Oh, holy shit. Three shields. Well, I guess we have no chance against this guy. We cannot hurt him and he tries to run away. So we should... We have no chance. Well, if both our shots hit... No, no chance. We need full engine power to run away as quickly as we can. I'll probably do it like this. And keep that online and train our shooting guy a little. What a nasty ship we have to get out of here. <sighs> Oh man, I guess I'd better... Mm -hmm. I do not want him to run away before we can run, so I'll use this thing on him. Delay his uh, crew at least for a while. Now they are charging again. And this weapon is charged a little slower. Hopefully we can dodge some of his... Uh, The beams on board, I think. Where? Oh, in the cockpit. Come on, get over there, help him. Not get hurt. That's good. So that we can charge our engine faster than he can. We need to retreat as quickly as we can. Oh crap. Yes, his uh, his uh. We can't actually hurt him. Whoa! Surprise! I'm not sure if we should try it. Okay, now our helper beam is charged. If our next chain laser hits again with both shots, jump imminent. No, that's too risky. We have to go away. That was a little stupid of me. Hellstar is also in danger. What's going on here? After a short time, you receive a message. Hello. I hope it's not a bother, but I'm looking for an escort to a nearby system. This region is quite dangerous and our ship is not well armed. And they give us free fuel, therefore. Thank you. Did you know that I was just short on fuel? Okay, uh, you please get out of here. Do not let yourself get killed. Good. So, so the eagle, please be so kind and kill this guy. Excellent. <sighs> In the end, we could actually have fought this guy. We can get through three shields with these weapons. Well, that's good to know. But it would have been very risky and would have been very likely that we would have got some damage. And, uh, I think it was okay to run away from this fight. Not a shame. We do not need a sh store right now, do we? We have got only this thing to sell. Boarding drone. No, that's not worth it. That's an empty jump. Let's go for the distress call.
you follow the distress beacon to a tiny asteroid belt. You find a small ship struggling to maneuver through the field. Hail them to offer assistance. Help! Our shields are down and we won't last long. Let's try to shield them with our ship. Four points of damage. Oh my god, that was a lot. <laughs> Crap. Uh, what do we do now? One, two. One, two, three, four. Have we still got four jumps? One, two, three, four. I think we should. Yes, I think we should. Wait, let me take a short look. It is uh, here. Twice that length is about here. And that's Is that half the way? That's too dangerous. You know what? I'm going to get myself a ruler and ah, find out that way. I should have a ruler somewhere around here. Ah, yeah, here it is. Not take another stupid risk. So, we have got... Um, it is a hole of 7.5 centimeters. And it is 1.53. Yeah, I think I think we have got five millimeters uh, <laughs> that uh, allow us to do the fourth jump. <laughs> but do we want to go here or there? I think we go down here. I hope I did not miscalculate it in any way. We get an anti combi drone. A small NG research vessel is trying to fend off a mantis ship. You move in to engage, but after a quick scan of your ship, the Mantis ship retreats. The Angel offers you a drone schematic as thanks for your timely arrival. Okay, now we could actually use a shop to repair our ship, buy some fuel. What's going on here? The, uh, they insist they must destroy your ship to prevent the virus. Ooh, a virus! I know what that means. Um, I have my NG negotiated with them. I do that. Um, as the NG attempts to contact... That's this virus. I, as the NG attempts to contact the vessel and negotiate, your NG crewmate as a member suddenly dissolves into nanites. The virus has murdered again. Detecting activity on board your ship, the NG vessel opens fire. So, let us see what we have here. One shot. One shot. Lots of defensive drones. Three shields. We know now that we can get through three shields. They can, more or less, they cannot go through our second layer of shields. So we always keep at least one. But if those both synchronize well, they can hurt us. But not very badly. I think we are quite well against them. Also they have no means of healing so we were from the very start well maybe not from the very start of oh, well, but why not let us uh, attack their their weapon systems. Why don't the others try to stop him? Well that's a little surprising. Okay, here they come, changing positions. And this guy shoots everything at their well, shield. Good, excellent. Directly get our first hit in. Our shield shoot through the shields, the oxygen and the weapons. Nice. Now he cannot hurt us, at least for a while. I think that should not be a, too much of a dangerous fight. I will not auto fire this one though, I will wait till the halberd is loaded. Because there's three engines there repaired as quickly as the wind. Uh -huh. So, shoot the shields. Oh crap, one miss. Probably the next one. Mm -hmm. 
so. Now shoot this one, this one, this one. Nice. And I guess with the next one we can probably kill them. I do not know if we should kill them or if there was some special whatever we could do. By the way, next shoot will be a hit, I hope. So, shoot the laser. Mind control the captain. Destroy the ship. So, ah, and the very last shot goes in. Ah, bad timing. With the ship destroyed, you scrap it and uh, prepare to jump away. 35 scrap, that's a lot. Not again, no fuel. And to your surprise, your NG crew member reforms. It looks as if the virus reconstituated, uh, repurposed, uh, and reprogrammed the NG host and wants to travel with you. And it seems to have learned a great deal from its time on your ship. As you can see, now this guy is not called Solar Eagle anymore, now he's called Virus. And since Virus is a very nice uh, fresh metal band from Great Britain, although not uh, power metal, but uh, fresh metal is okay to me, <laughs> so I think I will leave him with this name. So the eagle just turned into virus. Interesting, interesting. So, and virus has got full scales on each and every of the different uh, skills that he could get. I think I will leave him in the doors anyway because he's got a full repair skill. That's his job to run around, wandering NG, and repair everything that goes damaged. Ah, too bad we got those two points of damage. Didn't like that. So, but we have a quest to finish down here. Everything ready? Yes, let's do that. We also have got a lot of scrap. Do we want to do anything particularly nice with that? Probably extra energy. Well, m maybe not yet. Um, I think sooner or later we will definitely want another engine. Engine. Let's upgrade the engine to five. I think that's good. And now jump down here. You escort the ship to the requested beacon. Much to your dismay, you are ambushed by a rebel ship. You walk right into the trap. But they are not two. Okay, two shots. Two shots. That's not so good. A teleporter and three shields. Okie dokie. But no healing device. Let's try to make use of that. Yes. So if they kill this guy two and one, that would be amazing. Because they cannot get him back. It's a double uh, heavy laser MK2, that's a dangerous weapon. So, shoot his shields. Ah, oh, crap, didn't work. Shoot the shields again. And I think they actually killed their first crewman. That's fine. Bolton shield is down. And we can finally hurt them. So through this, that and that. And they teleported over to our ship. That's nice of them. I will send my guys over there to kill him. I think I'll use both NGs for that job. Which is the worst possible setup. Um, <laughs> No, he has to continue learning how to fire. Uh, he could also, of course, put that online. So, so. Send an NG and one of these Zoltans. Ah, crap! What am I doing? Weapons are down. Online. I uh, put the shields offline. I Idiot me. Meanwhile, 
you work on destroying the shields. That's good. He will not be able to dodge our next laser volley. The guy on our ship is dead. Everybody back to your stations. Could we probably even kill them? I'll try that. Just shoot the guys. Yeah, that's good. I think we will be able to kill his crew. At the moment he's not... Ah, let's shoot one laser in here. One of them is dead. And one more shot and he will be out. We will kill the crew. Fine. And down. Excellent. Now that their ship has been emptied and host, uh, of hostiles, you search it, eventually you, find, eventually you find a prisoner who offers to join your crew, which is yet another Zoltan. Okay, we need another Solar Eagle, I guess. So, that's you. <laughs> Solar Eagle. And I think we're on a very good way to get our... Uh, to get our challenge done. Remember, our aim is to get 29 power into our ship, and we've already got four power from these four Zoltans, which power our whole shields, and we've got uh, the bonus battery for two additional power. If we now, four, five, six, battery upgrade would be eight, so we would just need that full, that full, and one more, then power everything, and we would have our challenge done. Jump to the exit? I think we want to jump to the exit, but first let's heal our injured guys, a virus and Jack Panzer. We're a little low on fuel and we're a little low, low on hull points. That's the biggest problem. We would need a shop sooner or later, rather sooner than later. So save the positions. But apart from that, that looks quite fine to me. Come on. What's this? Another rebel checkpoint is monitoring this location. A number of civilian ships are awaiting inspections. Any of them could be Federation loyalists. The rebels haven't noticed you yet. Uh, could bribe the rebels to release the civilian ships. Stay quiet or we could fight. I think we want to fight. What do we have here? A uh, missile, that's not so good. They have got two uh, shield drones, that's also a little annoying. They have got a uh, map bay. I think we should best try to get through their shields as quickly as we can. If we can take out his missile, that would be 50% of what we need to reach. But that's not going to be very easy because he's got this annoying shield drone. Take full dodge, by the way. Oh, <laughs> it was nothing. <sighs> missile luckily does just one point of damage, but still I would not like to be hit by this missile too often. Let me just, by the way, start to... Oh crap, I cannot do that right now. Need to get his special shield down first. So I like to get uh, the chain laser to quick shooting as quickly as possible. One hit by the missile. I think the missile will be able to do a lot more damage to us, but hopefully not too much. Oh, to the weapons! <laughs> Fuck. Repair it quickly, please. I think the quick chain leader is even more important in this fight. I think we have just to eat a couple of missiles. 
Hopefully we'll dodge a couple of them. Oh, yes, the shields. Oh, that's not a bad idea. I want to kill him. I just hope we will run out of missiles soon. And usually we should also dodge a little. We've got a dodge chance of 45%. We dodged the missile. Good. It's risky. That's risky. Probably that's a mistake. Probably I should better not do that. And you know what? I should not do that. We already got enough damage. Rock Homeworld or Rebel Stronghold? Both is dangerous. Rocks have more missiles, so I think I go to the Rebels. Ah, crap. Why did I do that fight? I should have retreated earlier. We have just two few left and we are very low on hull. So as good as our ship looks all in all, so bad is the uh, current... Oh, what's going on there? Oh, I had these doors open because I'm an idiot. If we get our ship back to fuel and back to uh, hull points, then we will be doing very, very well. We somehow have to reach that first. So, we are at a very critical phase of the game. I would have loved to get a little more scrap in the last sector, but somehow it didn't work as I hoped. We need to store as quickly as possible. That's the most important thing. So, cross your fingers, guys. I hope to see you all again for the next episode, which will surely be extremely exciting. Until then, bye, everybody.